Soldatin, on fighting, killing, and dying, the secret World War II transcripts of German POWs, by Sank Neitzel offers a remarkable glimpse into the minds and experiences of German soldiers during World War II. Neitzel, a historian and researcher, compiled and analyzed a treasure trove of secret recordings of conversations among German prisoners of war, POWs, held in British captivity. These candid conversations provide invaluable insights into the thoughts, attitudes, and experiences of ordinary soldiers on the Eastern and Western fronts. Neitzel's work challenges many preconceptions about the German military during World War II. It paints a complex picture of the soldiers who fought for Nazi Germany, revealing that they were not merely blind followers of Hitler's ideology, but individuals with diverse beliefs, motivations, and attitudes. The book presents a multifaceted analysis of the soldiers' views on various aspects of the war, including their perceptions of their enemies, their thoughts on leadership, and their personal reflections on the morality of their actions. One of the book's central themes is the soldiers' attitudes towards their enemies. Neitzel's transcripts show that German soldiers often expressed a surprising degree of respect for their adversaries, particularly for the Soviets. This challenges the stereotype of German soldiers as fanatical Nazis bent on world domination. Instead, it suggests that many soldiers held a pragmatic view of the war and respected the combat skills and determination of their opponents. The book also sheds light on the soldiers' perceptions of their own leadership. While some expressed loyalty to Hitler and his regime, others criticized the military leadership for strategic blunders and the harsh treatment of soldiers. Neitzel's analysis reveals that many soldiers were acutely aware of the failings of their superiors and grappled with a sense of disillusionment. Furthermore, Soldatin explores the soldiers' experiences of combat and their reflections on killing. The transcripts reveal that for many, the reality of war was far different from the glorified image portrayed by Nazi propaganda. Soldiers grappled with the moral and psychological challenges of taking human lives, and many expressed remorse and horror at the violence they had witnessed and participated in. This humanizes the soldiers and underscores the moral complexities of warfare. One of the book's strengths is its meticulous analysis of the language used by the soldiers. Neitzel pays careful attention to the words and phrases employed by the POWs, offering valuable insights into their mindset. He also highlights the role of humor as a coping mechanism in the face of the horrors of war. This linguistic analysis adds depth to our understanding of the soldiers' experiences. The book structure is well organized, with Neitzel providing context and commentary throughout the transcripts. This helps readers navigate the sometimes challenging language and slang used by the soldiers. Additionally, Neitzel's introductory chapters provide essential background information on the transcripts' origin and the methodology used in their collection and analysis. While Soldatin is an invaluable resource for historians and scholars, it also has broader significance. It challenges the simplistic narratives that often dominate discussions of World War II and reminds us of the complexity of human behavior during times of conflict. By humanizing the German soldiers, the book encourages readers to consider the individual choices and moral dilemmas faced by those caught up in the machinery of war. However, the book does have some limitations. It primarily focuses on the perspectives of German soldiers on the eastern and western fronts and does not delve deeply into the experiences of soldiers on other fronts or the atrocities committed by Nazi forces. Additionally, while Neitzel provides valuable analysis, some readers may find the extensive use of transcripts and direct quotations dense and at times challenging to follow. In conclusion, Soldatin, On Fighting, 
killing, and dying, the secret World War II transcripts of German POWs, by Sank Neitzel offers a compelling and nuanced exploration of the experiences and attitudes of German soldiers during World War II. It challenges stereotypes, humanizes the soldiers, and provides valuable insights into the moral and psychological complexities of warfare. While it may be a dense read for some, it is an essential work for anyone seeking a deeper understanding of the human dimension of one of the most devastating conflicts in history. Neitzel's meticulous research and thoughtful analysis make this book a significant contribution to the study of World War II and the psychology of war.